To measure the time delay from the speakers to your ear, you need a measuring microphone. In this example, I use a Soundman OKM2 Classic with a uh, microphone preamp A3. Your, uh, yes, you need a microphone preamplifier to bring the signal to a line level. Um, if you when when you connect the microphone with a preamplifier and uh, DSP, you connect it uh, simple to any free line input. Um, be sure the, the microphone preamplifier is off or the microphone uh, isn't connected with the microphone preamp. You also can use uh, a monoral measuring microphone with your preamp and you can split the mono monoral signal to both uh, line inputs of your DSP but it's not recommended because the right measuring must be left speaker to left ear and right speaker to right ear. The measuring itself, um, the DSP sends a Dirac pulse, a very short pulse to the speaker. The DSP measure the time when this pulse is arriving on the microphone, at the microphone. Time delay measuring. In this example I have connected my um, stereo microphone, my in-ear microphone, to the input 5 and 6 of my DSP. I check in mixer, the input 5 and 6 is not connected to any speaker. So I can switch on my microphone preamp or connect my microphone without the danger of a lasting effect, a feedback. Okay, I go in the measure menu. I press the button MIC connected. Now it's blue and when the button uh, MIC connected is uh, lights blue, all inputs are muted and only the measuring input is opened for the measuring. I press the button set mixer. With the button set mixer all speakers are connected to input 7 and 8. 7 and 8 is my signal generator. I choose the input where my microphone is connected. In my case I've told you the input 7 and 8. And now I can start channel by channel the measuring with the, uh, the measuring buttons in this pattern. I press the button to start and again to stop the measuring. You see the delay from uh, from leaving the Dirac pulse from DSP to incoming Dirac pulse to the microphone on the left side, on the right side. Now I can send, calculate the correction, can uh, adjust the phase. If any speaker is out of phase, um, the, the connection is wrong, it uh, will display it in red and you can uh, send the adjustment to the DSP and you can send the correction, the adjustment for the gain difference. In this case the left speaker must reduce by 1 dB. Okay, I'll press the button call value and send to DSP. I'll show you what's happened in my preset. Now is the time delay 0 0.99 milli millisecond and the left channel is uh, reduced minus 1 dB. I have a visual feedback over the speaker distance from head. The, the center is the head and this shows you the distance to the speakers. Okay, to check my adjustment I press the button done reset 
and measure again. And now I have perfectly matched 3.96 milliseconds on both sides with a gain difference from 0 dB. My time delay is adjusted. This procedure I can do with all channels in an active system, speaker by speaker. After I have done the measuring, I press the button Recall mix Mixer. Now my mixer is set back uh, to my, my old settings. I disconnect my microphone or switch off the microphone preamp and I press the button Mic Connected so all inputs are unmuted for music.